Now, if this is uh, one of the classic magic tricks, um, the, the famous sponge ball trick, the sponge all the way through and it moves around and it doubles and I can show you the strange Where's things it down? does. I'm actually going to teach you this trick because it's an old classic and you'll be able to go home doing it yourself. Fine. So if you put your hand out, yeah. um, one ball goes into my hand and one goes into yours. You squeeze it very tightly yes. and turn your hand upside down. Now Eve, you can actually feel it in there. Yes. And you're sure it's there? I am. And you trust me. I do. You do and that really helps. Because my ball gradually melts away completely, travels down very slowly. I'm being paid, I may as well act and it arrives in your hand, and you can feel it arriving there? No. No, turn your hand over very, very slowly indeed. Open your hand up and have a little look. And you check this out. And Good you do, in fact, heavens. get my one as well. Now, I, I have, uh, I've got a few hundred like in my that. pocket. I'm so not I'm sure I like people putting a spare ball in my hand when I'm not noticing. Coming up in half an hour, the Have I Got News for You team look back over the best bits of this year, thus giving themselves a chance to get sued all over again, allegedly. In the wartime kitchen and garden, now on BBC Two, despite the war drawing to an end, rationing was still a necessity, meat was scarce, and every housewife learnt how to skin a rabbit.